Perspective drawing is a technique to create the linear illusion of depth. As objects get further away from the viewer, they appear to decrease in size at a constant rate. It joins isometric and oblique topics we've covered before as 3D projections. Okay, so how many types of perspective drawings do we actually have? Well, there are three. You have one point perspective, two point perspective, and you might have guessed three point perspective. So what we're going to do is we're going to look at each of them. We're going to look at some examples and highlight some facts as well. Okay, so let's look at some factors or characteristics of perspective drawings. First off, you have the object, of course. You have the horizon line. You have the vanishing points and you have the vanishing lines. All right, so each perspective drawing must have these four things. And um, we are going to look at them as i said earlier we're going to look at them now in detail and identify them for one point two point and three point perspectives okay so let's look at the one point perspective drawing so we have our objects which are two cuboids in this case and we have our horizon which is a c line a c we have our vanishing point, which is point B. And our vanishing lines are all the lines heading from our objects to point B. All right, so we have identified the four characteristics. And this is an example of a one point vanishing, a one point perspective, sorry. Okay, so let's look at this other drawing. It is a two-point perspective. We have our object, which in this case is a cuboid, it looks like, or a cube. We have our horizon line, which is line AB. We have our vanishing points, which are points A and B. And our vanishing lines, as you can see, they go from the cube or cuboid they go from the object to the vanishing points, right? So we have identified all the factors. And this is a simple example of a two point perspective. And lastly, we have our three point perspective. Again, the object is there. We have our horizon line, it's A, B. We have our vanishing lines. They are going to A and B. But as you can clearly see, we have a third point. It's point C. So we have three vanishing points. We have A, B, and C. So when you add a third vanishing point in a three-point perspective, you usually change the shape of the object in a vertical manner that's how it's usually done all right so the horizontal the horizon line and the horizontal vanishing points usually affect you know the horizontal shape of the object but when you add that third vanishing point it now affects the vertical shape as well so these are examples of the three different perspective drawings, the two, three different types of perspectives. So this is the intro to perspective drawings. We looked at the three different types. We looked at what they are, we looked at the factors, and the next drawing in this series 
we'll highlight or we'll look at how to actually draw it right so we'll go through that process and you will come along with me if you haven't already please subscribe and like this video if you have learned anything